So we're back today at the Builders Hub. Um, we're on this panelling job today. This is the plastic hollow panelling. We've been called out to this job. We didn't install it, um, but the customer wasn't very happy with it. As you can see, there's a hole in it there where someone's just dropped and dinked it. You look over here, there's also another dink there where the door handles just kind of hit that. So like I did say before, it's really weak stuff. Um, so yeah, I don't recommend it. And this is the issue you do have, it is so weak, it does dink. So yeah, we're gonna get all this out today and start again with um, the proper stuff. All right, here we go. It's all coming off now. Be careful up there, it's tall, but yeah. That's it, they're all coming off. I'm gonna show you how weak they are as well in a little while. Yeah, I think they're just stuck on there with silicon. I think it's supposed to be a proper wet run company that does this. Um, but they're obviously just using the cheap boards for a cheap finish. So we're gonna do it properly this time. This is where we're at now. We've got all the old sheets off. Um, they've just used silicon to stick it. So I've just uh, got my big scraper out to get off what I can. Gonna get all that off, clean that off a little bit. And then we're gonna start again using the multi-panel rather than the thin plastic stuff. But yeah, it's come off all right. Being silicon, I don't think it's stuck as well. So I managed to uh, get the sheet. It did stick well, but probably not as well if you use the um, high grab adhesive. So it was lucky for me. Didn't even pull the tiles off. I think I lost one there. Right up there. So yeah, it was all good. So yes, we're going to clean off and then, um, yeah, get cracking again. It's going to be a bit awkward, tricky around this window here, but we'll figure that out. So yeah, right, let's do this. So we are all full steam ahead now on this one. I've got this one in. Always start with the back, really. I could have come and done this one now, but I'm going to get this back wall done. Um, yeah, so that one's all stuck. So I'm just gonna put the camera down and then show you, show you what I'm doing. So you see, we're it's coming along now. I've got these, this is two boards in here. Done the back wall first. Siliconed it, silicon that edge before I put it in. Um, cleaned it all off. So yeah, these are obviously, if you've done that with one of my other boards, you probably put your boot through it, but these are super solid. Got the trimming down there. Sometimes you might find this wall had a bit of a bow in it. And when I cut it on my rail saw, I didn't cut that bow into it. So if you see, you can just see that line there, can't you? But that trim wants to come. Now like that's so all I've got to do is put a couple of packers in behind there. And then that's going to hold that wall all nice and level. If I don't put the packers in there, if I go to board this wall, it's going to push that and open that out. So I'm going to get packers in there, pack that all nice and tight and then carry on with that one. All right, here we go. So there we have it, it's all done now. Yep. All done. So yeah, sorry, it's just a short video, but we're a bit pushed for time today. But yeah, so the, the cheap paneling's gone, and now they've got the, uh, yeah, the good stuff. So yeah, let's give you a little tour. It's quite hard to film this one. Get Chris in it. He loves it. Chrissy boy is a plumber. So yeah, not too much disturbance for the customer. It's just a day to get this done. Um, just show you what they do if you are doing a wet room. It's good if the panel kind of over, you can see that overhangs. So it's good if you get an overhang like that, so then the water is gonna run down the board and then drip straight straight down rather than hitting the top of that trim. So I don't know if you can see that. So yeah, that's that. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the video, hit the like button. If you wanna subscribe for more, thank you.